So hi everyone, today's video I'm going to make a review of this uh, bladeless uh, fan. The brand is Aclear, comes with the remote control, so make sure you stick up till the end uh, to see all the functions and also I would really appreciate if you would like to subscribe to my channel. So uh, let's get into the details. So this is the first overview of the fan. It comes this uh, nice branding over here and also comes in different colors. Uh, it has these holes over here that basically take the air and remove it uh, uh, from the top part. Uh, here this, uh, this base uh, has at the bottom, it has uh, these uh, anti-slip legs, uh, four of them, so uh, it's quite stable on the table. It also rotates, but for this one we will have to uh, switch it on. So there are two options to do it, using the remote control, obviously the power button, or uh, just uh, pressing by pressing this button over here, which is touch screen. And every time we press this one, we can hear a beeping. And if you want to switch it off, you cannot do it from the uh, main uh, device. You have to press the power button. And basically, that's it. Once you plug it, it's going to be on. So uh, you can use this uh, uh, touch screen. Yeah, so this is the top part. Uh, we have different uh, holes over here. And uh, the fan removes the air in these ones. And uh, basically in the middle, uh, there is quite a lot of space. Uh, so I uh, consider that this is the main uh, feature of this uh, fan that is bladeless and uh, the design is quite cool. So these are the remote control looks like uh, and using the buttons, uh, we can control all the functions of this uh, uh, fan. Uh, basically, we have the power button in the middle and we have a plus and minus to control the intensity. Using these buttons left and right, uh, we can set the timer. Uh, using uh, this button, if we press it, it goes straight away to high speed. And using the other button, it goes straight away to low. And uh, we have this button over here, which uh, basically if you press, the air cooler will start to rotate uh, at a 45 degree angle. Now I'll discuss about the speed. Uh, now it's on uh, low mode. And uh, I'll just hold here a piece of paper to show you what is the power. And I will slowly increase the power. This is uh, the first speed, second speed, third, fourth, fifth. We have the sixth, seventh. 8, which is quite powerful. And this is the maximum speed we can get with it. Now I'll show you how noisy this device is. I'm just gonna move the microphone a bit closer. Now it's on uh, slow mode. mode. It's the first speed. Now I'll take you through the building quality, uh, which in my opinion is not that great. Uh, we can uh, hear that it's quite cheap plastic and uh, also is the, on, especially on this side, uh, it feels like in a couple of years probably it's going to crack. And it's also very lightweight, which uh, indicates that uh, the product is not as powerful as uh, uh, I might expect. Here it has uh, these holes uh, three, uh, all over the product, like 360, and uh, this is a good thing because it takes uh, a lot of air. But overall I cannot uh, say too many things about the building quality because in my opinion it's not that great. So my overall thoughts about this product, uh, I consider it to be quite cool uh, considering the design that it doesn't have any blades. I can't say that the building quality is really good. It also delivers a quite decent amount of wind and the functions uh, are quite cool and also it has this uh, uh, touchscreen option over here 
So do I recommend you to buy it or to drop it? Well, mm, probably somewhere in the middle. So if you want to find out more details about this uh, fan, there is a link in the description. And also, if you found this video helpful, I would really appreciate it if you can tap the like button or even consider it to subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.